in Bradford have generally known to a certain extent anyway. But there's been uh, some kind of confusion about uh, how much of a problem it actually is. Now, if you look at it from a realistic point of view, um, if you have been told this particular information and you look around you and you see that there's been a number of cousin marriages within your family and very clearly there's been no evidence of congenital anomalies and no sort of any issue along those lines. So it doesn't seem to be an immediate risk to you nor does it seem something real. Um, but what we're doing, we're looking from a statistical point of view and mm-hmm. something which does exist that there is a, a double risk in this particular instance. Now, well, so, so would you say to a, a, a couple or a patient you have to put the view about, you know, God will decide to one side because these are the stats. This is the evidence. Our, our approach, I mean, at the end of the day, the, the way we would approach uh, couples or families is we would actually uh, present the, the statistics. Mm. We would actually very, and we would present it in a way that the patients of the family